miss you too. <laughs> Stop kidding. Uh huh. So when will you grow up, this overgrown baby of mine? <laughs> okay. Yeah, Tommy is sleeping. They call Elia. Alright. Okay, baby, I really need to sleep now. I'm very, very tired. Okay. <laughs> I love you too. Uh huh. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Alright. Jeff, why do you place your club over God? Why? All right. Well, I'll see you when we get back. Yeah, we're going to church now. Okay. Yeah, bye. Please have mercy on my husband. Touch him for me, please. Oh, um, Tony, hurry up, please. Or oh, maybe still meet me outside. Are you still mad at me? Come on, baby. I know I messed up. Please just forgive me. Jeff, you are always messing up. Simple prayers you cannot do. You are the man of this house. You're supposed to draw us more closer to God, but you are not. Oh, no, baby. Oh. It's not the way it sounds. Okay? And I just said I'm sorry. Forgive me, all right? Sweetheart, baby, <laughs> forgive me, alright? I'm sorry. You know I can't be mad at you for long, and that is why you take me for granted. I'm sorry. Come, come sit with me. Come sit with daddy, alright? That's my girl. Baby, <laughs> <laughs> um, what about Tony? Has he gone to bed? Yes, he has. Okay. So, what is it? Why are you excited? Um, baby, uh, it's just that I don't want to be interrupted, okay? What do you take me for? I'm really in trouble, okay? I don't, I don't get it. Of course not. Baby, I got us a brand new car. Yeah, from the money I made from the last business I had with the last GPO. And, you know, it was, it, it, what I actually got was a BMW X6. It's a brand new one. Baby, you will love it. You did what? You will love it, baby. Jeff! Baby, what is wrong with that? Why are you angry? I only want us to live lives like every other rich family out there. And what is wrong with that? Everything! Jeff, everything is wrong with it. You bought a new car without consulting me, right? Maybe this was supposed to be a good news. For God's sake, I am only trying 
to make us live as every other rich family out there. And what is wrong with that? I am not angry because you didn't tell me at first. You should have, should have invested the money in our small business. My beauty salon can just make it big, make it large before thinking of getting a new car. Can't you see? Really? Really? And that is one thing that pisses me off where you are. Yes! Yes! Your, your, your sense of ambition is. is Why? Why? Invest more on your beauty shop? Then what happens to me? What about me? What am I going to do? Track around? But we have a chief, an Akura. Isn't that enough for now? Um, good thing. What I want is for us to upgrade. That way I can get more business connections. More business contacts. That is what I want. You know what? I'm going to bed. Don't take this. For how long? You need to upgrade yourself. Really? He wants me to be excited when the news is not an interesting one. God, Jeff, for how long will you continue like this? How great our status, my fools. The love of money is the root of evil. Hello, baby. The devil is it. So Hello, baby. Come on. You got the machine. You like it? Baby, this car is so clean. Oh, baby. This is lovely. Wow, baby. Do you like it? Come on. You want the baby? Come on. You don't like it. Baby, what is it? I've been calling you. Jeff, so you went ahead and brought in that car into this house. You refused to listen to me, your wife. God, look, baby, um, I know I know you're angry with me, okay? But at least you should have checked it out first. Check what out? Jeff, I am not interested. I am not! You love it. Huh? Love what? Jeff, you use the money I am supposed to stock up my shop with to get a car. A luxurious car for that matter. And you want me to be happy about it? Really? Baby, look. I should have gotten a BMW X6. But I went ahead to get a Lexus 350. Just so that we can have enough money for you to invest more in the salon and, you know, also have leftover for us to celebrate with. But, um, it's so why didn't you say, say so all this time? Because, you know, that girl was just on the way. So, uh, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry, huh? Uh, very well, that's okay. Um, now we're good. Yes. Can we go check out the car? Yes, let's go! <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, what is this? Let's go with friends. Okay. Keep some
You are a true prophet of God. You, you sounded as if uh, you doubt your power of God. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, you know, it's just that, you know, when, when, you, when you hear what you have heard somewhere in unison, it, it makes you feel excited. You have told me exactly what I have been told. The only difference now is that you did not mention the name. Really? Who explained it to you? Why did you come to see me again, even when you find an answer to your problem? Well, uh, man of God, you know, I, <clears throat> I went to a little doctor who took his time to explain everything to me, how my uncle wanted to kill me, how my uncle doesn't want to see me alive. You know, when I got home, my wife was never in support of it, and she said I should come and see you. You visited a native doctor. Is serious? Why? You know, um, Prophet of God, when a man finds himself in this my situation, I mean, if you as a person now find yourself in this my predicament, I, I am sure you will do everything possible. You will even go to see the devil himself in search of solution. I see. But you see, did your wife support the idea? No, no, no. If, if she had, I wouldn't have been there. She scolded me. My, my, wife, my wife was so mad, angry, and I don't know what she said. I should. I have to come and see her prophet. No sensible woman will allow her husband to visit that holy places. And, 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 and I can't do what the Lord just referred to me. You must not return back to that native doctor. Or else, you will run mad. Thank you, man. Uh, Prophet of God, run mad. God forbid. God forbid. God forbid. No, no, no. I. Okay. I have heard you. I have heard you. Uh, what now do I need to buy? What and what do I need to buy for, for this assignment to, to begin? As in, what will I bring for the physical uh, battle to, go to to commence? Brother Nega, you must come closer to God. You and your wife, you must join them together and worship God. He alone can erase your music and then fight your battle for you. Prophet of God, you don't understand what I mean. What I'm saying is, what do I need? Okay, if you don't want me to buy anything, how much do you want me to bring in cash, liquid cash, so I can bring it, so as you commence on the assignment, so you you be able to to turn around this whole situation. Okay, okay, man, don't fight battles. God fights battles. When you are closer to God, He will expose. He will reveal the secret and the plans of the evil ones to you. And for that man you're thinking that your uncle don't accuse anybody yet. <laughs> the lady doctor told me I should continue being friendly to my uncle. You are now telling me, okay, I have heard you people, no problem. I will continue. I have heard you people, I will continue being friendly. Until then you come and you see me lying down. You will pray and I will go down the grave. I'll continue this friendly, no problem. The love of my I'll continue this friendly. Is the root of evil. evil. The devil uses to gain a lot of Christians. God is the way. Hold on to God. He will see you true. He will save you. He will promote you. He will guide you. Bye. 
I take care of you like a child you don't have. The pastor and the little doctor said the same thing. Just that the pastor did not mention him. Mama. I won't clean my house. People say I should not go to farm. Eh? <laughs> this is what is one exercise I need to do to keep you fit. Hmm? So, Mama, how are you? I am fine, my son, as you can see. <laughs> eh? How are you and the people in the city? Oh, Mama, they are all fine. Hmm. Hmm, Mama, you are looking young there every day. <laughs> <laughs> so, tell me, what is the secret? My son, happiness. Oh. Happiness. Tell me, how is your brother and his family? Eh? Oh, have you seen him lately? Oh, my brother Jeff <laughs> and his family are fine. Yeah. Ew. Now, who is asking too much questions? <laughs> Come on, let's go in. Silly boy. <laughs>
As you can see, I'm fine. We're managing. Oh. Auntie Mabel, mm -hmm. my beautiful wife. Oh. How you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Let me get you a glass of water. Oh, thank you, my wife. All right. All right. So, Jeff, yeah. when did you return? Two days ago. Yes, yeah, you can see, still looking fresh. <laughs> So, how is Mama? I heard you recently went to see her. Oh, Mama is fine. Oh, she's looking younger than the last time you saw her. <laughs> you can say you that. You are very naughty. Oh, hmm, how oh, can you say that? Sorry. Thank you, Auntie Mendo. You're Mama. welcome. Mama is actually looking like a sweet 16. <laughs> so why waste the beauty? <laughs> <laughs> See, I don't have the strength. Hmm? Mm -hmm. I'm just going inside and prepare your room. No excuse today. You are spending the night with us. Okay? All right. All right, let me leave this. Yeah. All right. Baby. Mm -hmm. I'll just join you soon. All right. <laughs> hmm. Well, she's getting better by the day. <laughs> you can say that again. She's like an old wine. You know, considering the fact that um, you and Mama actually never wanted me to marry her because she's too churchy and holy and all that. <laughs> Come on, that was before I gave my life to Christ. And besides, you know, most of these church girls, they pretend a lot. Uh, you know, if I'd actually listened to both of you, I would have missed a treasure. <laughs> Even Mama has confessed that. Uh, right now, the both of them are inseparable, so... <laughs> yeah, ah yes, that is what. So tell me, tell me about your new ambition of becoming a pastor. <laughs> a pastor? Come on, no way! Who told you such a thing? Oh, come on. Mama told me that the last time I called her. Mama, she wouldn't be a drama queen. <laughs> I mustn't be a pastor to serve God. The size, they are already part in the church which can sound good. So, um, <laughs> you know, um, Ben, um, I'm not against you working for God, you just starting here. You know what I'm actually trying to talk about is, since you, you know, if I could actually take over your business, now you want to work for God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, and when are you going to work for God? Um, that will be a topic for another day. 
All right, because presently my wife is doing that for the protocol. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, how is business so far? I can't believe you just allowed that to ruin her ego. Oh! Was I supposed to turn a blind eye while she practically ran her fingers all over my husband? Are you okay? Are you insane? That girl is just speaking to She was just being friendly. What would you have me do? Suck her. Because I don't want to ever set eyes on that slot again. What nonsense! Saka. I. I thought you were supposed to be a holy How would you do this to me? Saka! I'm not saying God was the cop for your security! You must be joking, you. Oh! Working according to plan? Uh, yes, everything is working out just the way we planned it. Hmm? You don't need to be worried. All I want you to do is to make sure you milk him and, and get my shot to me. Eh? Makana Odinba. Odezibumba. As for the boy, I will make sure the boy is well taken care of. Money should be the least of your problems now. I'll get you as much as it's long for. Just make sure the boy is safe and sound. <laughs> don't, don't worry about that. Eh? Hmm. Don't worry. Eh? I shall be going to see the right man. Okay. So. Yes. Yeah. Hey. Hey, okay. Uh oh. <laughs> again and again. 
Yeah? Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah? Hey. Yes, I'm fine. It's just a um, little headache. A little headache? Yeah, I think you need to see the doctor. No, no, no doctor. Okay, just go ahead and see what you wanted to see. I'll be fine. Um, well, if you say so. You know what, baby? Okay. I've decided to go into oil and gas business. <laughs> oh, I see. Um, ben has been able to convince you, right? Come on. Come on, baby. What do you mean by that? Gosh, he can't convince me to join this electronic business. Well, I've decided to go into oil and gas. Uh, oil and gas? Yeah, oil and gas. Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me, Ben. Hello? Oh, Makus, what's up? At the club? Okay, okay, very well. I'll meet you there. Thank you. <laughs> well, baby, um, I have to run now, okay? You still haven't told me what you meant by oil oh, and gas business. God. Trust me, okay? Just trust me. I'll be fine. And I hope it's a genuine business. Yeah, of course. I'll see you soon. Alright. God, please, protect him for me and the kid, please. Human being that is spotted in that vicinity will be working for us. Yes, um, I was actually looking at um, doing a more short and legal on the things. What I actually did come to look. Don't tell me you are chickening out now that our plans are visible. Organize that. Sure. This is the big thing. This is the big thing. This is the platform that we need. You may be like, okay, no, no, let me make it. You know, I, I, I really don't know how to do it. But this is my life. Yes, you call it. How you You know what I call it? I, I I don't know I don't know how to explain this to you. I don't know how to draw the chart, but let me try as much as possible. You know, as little as I can. Look at this. To you, the bonkle, huh? And I call it when I said previously. Look at this. This is a platform. A platform that we. Assure us of tomorrow. A platform that we can actually plant a seed, watch the seed grow, and when it grows, watch the seed germinate, I mean, make beer food, and when it gets food, you see us plucking money like we're plucking food. That's what I'm talking about. Now, 
right time for such announcement. I promise I will tell him soon. I promise, Mama. Hmm. Hmm. Mama, I will tell okay. him. Okay. If you say so. Now that you are in my house, okay. eh? I'm going to take care of you, my grandson, including the one in your room. Mm-hmm. So tell me, what are you going to eat? Ah, Mama, no. Relax. Oh my, you want to spoil me? You not get me cook for you. I have to. I'm your daughter. Mm-hmm. Oh, no way. Not in this condition. Eh? I don't want any food, oh. Eh? So, I will cook. Oh. Uh, hmm. So, you told me over the phone, you sent it, that uh, you'll be coming to visit me in two weeks' time. Is he not going back today? Uh, Mama, uh, they extended his off this time. Instead of one month, they gave him two. Mm. Yes, Mama. Okay. I was beginning to think uh, that was a problem somewhere. But then, uh, why was he busy then? Uh, uh, um, you know what? You worry so much. Huh? Why not go to the market and get a spot in you? Huh? While I check on that lazy grandson of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Mm. I will go. Okay. But make sure you have enough rest. Eh? Yes, Mama. Remember your condition. <laughs> eh? <laughs> okay. 
But let me go and get my bag. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, Mama, hurry up and come back on time. Uh, yeah. And she will bring up again. Yes, Mama. I just like to come. Oh, please help me. Oh, please help me. Let him call your back. Please, I don't want Mama to know about this suspicion. No, I had to go home to confirm my husband's kids. This is me. We, we have got to be more careful. We need to be more careful. I mean, my wife is beginning to suspect us. Baby, why don't you, why don't you divorce her? And marry me. A full-fledged woman. She's a man. So, never you. Don't you ever, I mean, don't you ever in the whole of your life knowing me as a maker call my wife a man. Have you not done enough? For God's sake, haven't taken her husband. Is she not in love yet? You go further to call her names. You should. Hmm? Please forgive me. Okay. It's okay, it's okay. Thank you. Look, we need to be very careful. We need to be very, very careful. I don't want I don't want to get to know about your life. And that's why I am relieving you of your duty at the office. What? Rebecca? Are you in any way sacking me? So no. I am only trying to save my marriage. Save your marriage? I've been with you for four years now. That office is doing a short way for me to see you anytime. Baby, what about my emotions? Why are you doing this to me? Why? Is it because I love you so much? Sorry, huh? just get it. Don't you understand it? All I'm saying is, let's let's just let's just I mean apply a bit of caution. Let's let's be careful. Let's just be on a low key. Look, look, Zeno, I am going to make sure I provide every of your needs. Every one of them. All my needs. All your needs. Hmm. Okay. Then it's alright. I'm so happy right now, baby. Hmm? I want to show you how much I love you. Right. That's what you dreamt and I want to. Okay? And I want you more.
Your ancestors. Fool. You want to joke with me? I'm just wondering why you never did that once. I'm not even worried about you. I know. You know, I've been very busy running around. Yeah, yeah. I realize that. Which business is the issue on the ground? Are you going to tell my about the suspension? No. I was just hoping for my own business to progress. Before letting her know about it. She you know how Mama reacts to issues like this? Yes, you're right. So, how many days from the company? Have they certainly made that first? No. No. Not a word yet. But I've just decided to move on. Move on? Sure. Don't think you're giving up just like that. I'm not deciding to move on just like that. I just decided to move on. Period. <laughs> well, uh, if you say so, uh, uh, after all, you are the boss. Yeah. So, how is, how is your business going? Uh, it's been going perfectly well. Perfectly well. And I was hoping to introduce you uh, into the moving train. Uh, I would have loved to bet. Yeah, I'm okay, my little bit. I'm fine. <laughs> I was just trying to make you <laughs> Yeah, it's a lot of money going on. Uh, it's okay, I'm good. <laughs> so, hi, Mama so far. My wife is really fine. Oh, come on. Hey. Thank you very much for always thinking of me. What would I have done without you? Uncle, I don't know why you keep talking like this. You are my uncle. You know, my, 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 my mother's younger brother. You are more or less like a father to me. If I don't do it, if I don't provide your needs, who, who, will, I, who, who will I do that to? That's all right. Thank you. Thank you for being the child I don't have. Uh, at least for giving me a reason to be. Look, Uncle, you are beginning to talk like a market woman, and um, I think. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, where do you park? So I, I actually parked at my mother's place. I just decided to take a good walk. It's okay, my son. Uh, 
Black Chevron. Eh? And uh, remember to greet your wife for me. <laughs> eh? Yeah, that. You know, she has been she has been striving, she's been doing everything possible to come to come pay you a visit. But I know one of these days I will make her come and bring them to you. Oh, oh at least to come and see Uncle. Definitely. Eh? Definitely. Thank you very much. Thank you, Uncle. Right. 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 Thank you, Uncle. I'll get you what I get you. It's all right. Bye bye. Look at him. Full of money. Yet, he can make me a millionaire. Wicked boy. Who knows? Maybe he used my dead children to enhance his wealth. Yes. I am suspecting that boy. Seriously. <clears throat> he is even making a nyanka. Get all this pinopino. Pinopino. We shall see. We shall see. Look at him. I do everything for him. And yet, he's planning evil against me. I can see you already for church. And I can see that you have made up your mind to sit at home, despite all my pleas. Oh. Hey. Jeff, why are you so stubborn when it comes to the things of God? Why? Here you go again. Baby, I'm not rejecting God. Right? Uh, it's just that I have something to do this morning. Very important. Besides, you're already representing us. Yeah, and I trust your judgment. <laughs> but know this, that on the last day, every man will stand on his own. Hmm? Um, um, baby. Of course, uh, you know what? Baby, please, uh, I just wanted to try to come back on time today. Alright? Because if I make him my business partner and his wife are uh, coming to see us today. <sighs> And I would love you to meet with them. Okay? Okay, no okay. problem. I'll come back in time. <laughs> come back here. What is it? You can go to church this way. Hmm? Why don't you smile at it? <laughs> smile for me, baby. Huh? You sure do know how to make someone mad. God. Why not go to church? Yes! <laughs> um, okay, you know what? I promise next Sunday I'll join you guys. Hmm. Okay? Promise. I, I promise. And okay. if you do not, you I will... Do, do nothing, baby. You do absolutely nothing. But love me, baby. Yeah? Alright. <laughs> okay. Come on, share Okay? Share up with it. Okay. <laughs> so let me um, get to me. Okay, so Alright. Alright. Uh, uh, baby, uh, let me just chill out here a bit before I jet out. Okay? Okay. Uh, I, I, I get a pleasure having, you know, seeing you, meeting with you. I've heard a whole lot of things about you. Uh, it's a pleasure too. Um, very well. Let's, let's... The pleasure is also mine. Let me just be comfortable. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're welcome once again. You're welcome, Mrs. Oji. And welcome to our house. Thank you. Please call me Sonia. Oh, Sonia. Yeah. Um, yeah. Sonia. 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 This is born again, Christian. Okay. <laughs> wow, this is wonderful. Well, I haven't watched you on TV, but I've heard so much about you. <laughs> the famous Iron Lady of that. 
<laughs> you know, that name stuck exactly when she single-handedly handled some non-entities mm-hmm. who tried to introduce the children of our community into modernity. She told them, our community is the time of today. And, and that's <laughs> pretty. <laughs> and I love the fact that that name stuck. You know, to remind those good for nothing that our children are not meant to be tortured. Yeah. Thank God they stopped their immoral art and packed up. Yeah, they're <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, ladies, oh, ladies. God, uh, cool. If you don't mind, you have to excuse us. Business calls. <laughs> right. So, um. Okay. Okay. So, that is what I have been experiencing since my husband Jeff joined the business. <laughs> my word, I've been in this. I've been in it for the past five years now. Well, thank God for my son, Tony. He is the one keeping me company whenever I feel neglected. Uh, that's the one thing that I wish for more than anything in this world. Mm-hmm. To have a child of my own. You really don't have a child? Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Yeah, I'm so that's sorry. Good. So, how do you see this business of yours? Has your husband told you anything yet? You mean the oil and gas business? Was that what you called it? Yes, that was what I told you. I think calling it what it truly is will make you understand how dangerous it is. I, I, I don't understand. Can you please make me understand, please? What I'm saying is that our husbands are going into bunky business. It's a new way of getting oil. Bunky what? Shh. Hang down your voice. They, they may tell you. What they are about to do now is wrong in the sight of God and human. I have scolded my husband a million times, but he's so adamant. I don't know what else to do. I really don't know. And now I am worried. What if they get caught? What if they are exposed? My dear, let's just pray for them and ask God for his protection upon their lives. That's the only thing we can do for them. Google. My dear. It has finally happened. <laughs> the yellow and the blue oil have missed. The good news, my dear. It's the very good news. <laughs> like I told you, the business will not work. Hmm? I said the business will not work. They will surely come back to this village for our help. <laughs> look at them. Look at them. Look at them. They, they, they think that they are in the city. They can make the biggest money in this world. They don't know that me, me, you and I, I mean, you and I, are the ones who live in the city. We decide who to be rich and who to be poor. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that destiny is right. I'm a book, I'm a book. I'm a book, I'm a I'm a book. <laughs> you know what? Just make sure the sacrifice are intact. That is what I mean. That is my duty. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>
future. Why not? Especially when it has to do with seeking the future. <laughs> This? this is Ben. He's my brother in law and mm -hmm. also a believer. Hello, Mrs. Sonia. Hi. Uh, I'm a fan of yours. Wow. Uh, nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you for coming to pray with us. There is no better time now that they have traveled to the business point in Rivers. And well, that is the reason why I am so scared, so worried. No, okay. Look, my friend, you, you don't need all those all those words. All you just have to do is go down on your knees and call on Jesus. He's there to worry for you. He's there to carry all your burdens. You don't need this. Please. Just cheer up, okay? Are you okay? Now, now I remember where I met you. Yes. Oh my God. Ah, Is everything okay? I am fine. I am perfectly fine. Yeah. I saw you in my dream <laughs> two months ago. Wow. Yes. Those words were the exact same words you said to me. Yes. You, uh, you, you were my best friend. Yes, you encouraged me just like the way you're doing now. Oh my God! <laughs> what oh, Jesus. God has already designed our friendship even before our meeting. Oh, <laughs> oh my God! Uh, well, well, well. On that note, let's oh pray for God for direction. Yes, let us pray. Let us pray. So. In Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, hello. Uh, Pastor, I'm so sorry we did not tell you before we traveled. It was a It is okay. That's okay. So, how was the trip? I said the trip was bad. The trip was very bad. We lost a huge amount of money. I saw as I talked to you. We barely managed to escape with our lives. The chip was nothing to write home about. Uh, Brother Maker, that's what happened when you don't involve God in the business. You forgot that God is the author and finisher of all things. And that with Him, your teacher is guaranteed. You know, um, Pastor, please, let, let me let me pick this corner. Yes, hello. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. I, 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 I'm coming right now. Um, let me just draw my way. I, I'm coming right away, okay? Uh, uh, yes, yes. Um, Pastor, please do excuse me. Uh, let me add this to call. It's very important.
So I just want to walk a few things up. I'm going to walk a hubby. You decided to help out with a job instead of spending from 40 times to the worst time. I'm sorry, my love. Just give me some few moments and I'll wind up. Okay? Oh, okay. Yeah. So you're putting it right there. Sure you're getting the way you want it. Thank you. What about this? Okay. Um, I, I was still working on this thing. Let's see if I can fix it. Alright. Yeah. Now, who's getting busy? Zeno. Let me just have that. Hello, Zeno. Oh, what? Where was that? Oh my god, I'm sorry about that. Oh no, I can't I can't leave the house now. I I'll call you later, okay? Yeah. Let me just call. Oh my god. Since when did you become her personal doctor? I thought you sucked her. Why is she still calling your line? Look, this is just an innocent call. She just called that she's involved in an accident. Are you a relative? Or, or are you a parent? Why is she still calling you? So much for a family good time. Excuse me. Call me. Why, 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 are you always, why are you always why are you always picking things hard this way? This was just an innocent call. And you heard me say that I can't leave the house just for you. <sighs> Oh, Sino, why are you always doing this to me? Why are you always calling? Why are you always calling when, when, when I am... <sighs> Thank you. All this for me. Who am I? They are not only What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, it is inside. Let me get it for you. Oh, oh, oh. oh. <coughs> Greedy old fool. When I'm done with everything, I'll visit your mother. Do you want me to do? To, to, to pump him? 
remember that boy is a very important asset for me. Mm -hmm. I do not want to joke with him. Okay. How, how, how can you call your only child like that? Huh? First, you refuse to precede him when he was born. And you refuse to give him a name. Now you are calling him like that. Why are you so happy? Happy? Huh? You called me happy. No, no. You called me heartless. Hmm? Look at you. It's really the God of us who is happy. You are going to make your sister fall so dry. All in the bill become a millionaire. Huh? Which you do not have to Else, I'll take over the time from you. And you will never, ever. <laughs> you said, eh? come on now. Eh? You know, what are you hosting for? Huh? Just give me the horse. I wasn't sure from all those things I said, though. I was only joking. Eh? You're joking? Yes. Eh? Oh, of course, I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm so happy. Oh, okay. Make sure that happens. Oh, all right. I, I will. Eh? Hey. <laughs> I will, Lord. you here tonight for a reason. I want us to discuss about your decision with me. First, it was that oil business that almost claimed your life. Then, your ignorance towards the fact that you are an engineer. Nigga, 
Where is all this jibing and dress talk as if you're talking to our son Tony coming from? What's your point? I am talking about your suspension. You seem to have given up. Why? Why what? Why what? What do you want me to do? Tell me. Prayers, my love. Prayers can move mountains. Come and pray with me so God can open your case. Let him fight this battle for you. Uh, maybe. Do you know I lost millions in that business? And almost lost my life. Forgive me if I don't share your religious sentiments. But leave me out of it. Thank you. All I'm asking for you is to join me in prayers. Remember, prayers can move mountains. There is nothing prayers cannot do. Just join me. Let us fight this battle. Please, the company can recall you. Besides, we are suspended over another's mistake. Please. I see you just called out to get me upset this evening. Right? Well, you know what? If you want to pray, you can pray for the both of us. And leave me out of it. I'm not interested. I'll be in my mushroom. Jeff! Yes, I know you are keeping up, but I will not. I will continue to pray until God answer my prayers. I love this. God, God, please touch my husband's heart. God, I give him the reason to serve you. God, I make him your instrument, please. I can't do this alone. I can't fight this battle alone. Please, God, help me. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, I pray, I pray for this body, O Lord, I pray for divine healing, O Lord. I speak it into our body, I say by your strength we are healed, Father, this body is healed. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Father, in your word. You spell only your word, say, oh Lord. By your strength, we are healed. This body is healed in the name of Jesus. Father, you have been.